Hey guys, it's Lita from Sipnotech. I almost missed you just now because I was actually listening to music on my Zungle V2 sunglasses. Here's my full review. For full disclosure, we were sent the Zungle V2 Music sunglasses for review, but they are not paying us for our opinion, nor will they see this before you guys do. To be honest, I had no idea what to expect when I first opened the box. The sunglasses feature built-in bone conduction Bluetooth speakers, which is what allows you to connect to your device for voice assistance, music, and phone calls as well. On the outside, the aesthetics of the sunglasses are pretty well made and look sleek. The frame has a nice matte look to it while the changeable lenses fully protect your eyes from UV rays. I tested these out by taking them ATVing and I had no problem with dirt or sunlight getting into my eyes. I also wore them for extended periods of time and didn't have that weird fit where it squeezes your nose and gives off a tight fit after a while. These sunglasses were genuinely very comfortable to wear. The buttons along the bottom of the frame are used to control the sunglasses. By using Bluetooth 5.0, it can pair to any smart device. There is a little bit of an adoption period when it comes to the sunglasses. For a while, I was pushing different buttons to see what would happen and eventually figured out what controlled my music and what hung up the phone. And for the record, yes, I did read the manual, but real world use still takes time to get a feel for the button placements. The main intent of these sunglasses is the ability to listen to music. You can wear them while running, out on a walk, or simply when you're outside and don't feel like plugging in your headphones and taking out your phone. The speakers on the newer model are improved over last year's model due to the relocation of the placement closer to the ear. That helps improve on the Panther's biggest issue, which was that it produced weak sound. My only gripe about this was that once you started raising the volume, other people around you can hear sound from outside the sunglasses, which makes the experience a little weird sometimes especially to a random passerby. If you're in a loud area or ATVing like I was, it doesn't raise any issues. And in that case, the louder volume actually helps despite occasionally sounding a little distorted. Picking up phone calls was a lot easier than I expected on the Zungle Viper and everything was loud, clear, and crisp. It does help if you have your phone near you like in your pocket, purse, or backpack as the further you are away from your device, the weaker your Bluetooth tethering is. You have a very limited range. Otherwise, I had no problems using the phone calling feature and it was very convenient, especially when outdoors. Similarly enough, using the AI features on here was pretty easy as well. I was able to get my Google Assistant with a click of a button. As for charging, the Zungle sunglasses charge through a pogo pin mechanism. The legs of the sunglasses are simply pushed into the charging port and it takes a little under an hour to get about four hours of use. I did not feel the need to charge my sunglasses every day and it was rare that I had drained the entire battery in one sitting. Overall, the Zungle Viper sunglasses are definitely convenient if you're outdoors a lot or if you're a regular commuter. I can see the benefits of using them when biking, especially when you don't want to fully plug headphones in to drown out the outside noise. Compared to other higher quality sunglasses, I was really impressed with how this actually held up. Despite having additional functions, these glasses don't look too far off from traditional sporty sunglasses. The added features like AI and phone calling makes it all the more convenient, and it's just another example of how excited we are to be able to see what other wearables and exciting technology comes into play in the future. It's always fun checking out different tech, and this was unique in so many ways. 
Be sure to stay tuned for other similar videos in the future and I will see you guys next time. Bye! And that's it. Be sure to subscribe here. Hit the bell button so you don't miss any of our videos. And check out our other videos right here. Until next time.